only a matter of time. Bro, VTuber smash or pass, bro. And it went wrong. How did it go wrong? Time. How do you mess up smash or pass? As today we check oh, in with- Oh, we already saw the clip of this. Oh shit. Dragon right, let's spit. Go. A, you guessed it, Dragon VTuber. Giving us a happy hump day, everyone. And earlier submitting themselves. You saw this today? Oh boy. Session. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Boy, I already saw the clip, bro. This shit about to get spicy, bro. Get ready. Individuals decide if they're going to, well, smash or pass these streams generally done with fictional characters, but sometimes that summarizes it. Uh, I'm sure it gets deeper. YouTubers themselves. I'm sure it gets YouTubers deeper. Have, of course, real people behind the avatar. Yes, yes. Spit after one session taking to Twitter to say smash or pass streams are fun. And I don't actually care about being passed at all. It's okay. all for fun and for okay. seeing other VTubers. Okay. The issue is calling someone a Chrissy Beesh when they know nothing about that VTuber's personality or lore also it is rude i think this is it's this is a hard one because like is it rude to call someone a prissy bitch yes but at the same time some people actually say like they say this type of language not necessarily meaning like the bitch part like some people in some culture in some cultures people will just say bitch like what's up bitch like what's up bitch like bitch bitch like some people use it and it's like okay in that area but the thing is when th when you say this and it's streamed and already a majority of people uh they connotate the word bitch with something negative bro like it of course it could go bad so i could understand why she's mad about it and why it seems super rude even if she didn't mean it like that it could still be thrown off that way even how aggressive it sound when she said it or maybe she really thinks she is a prissy bitch i don't know i want to see both sides of the story to play out but i do want to hear like how did it get worse because i'm pretty sure it got worse if this is just it like i mean okay well y'all y'all just i don't know like it just is what it is <laughs> say, if she gets upset when people don't want to smash her character then you need to go touch grass this person it's, it's a ridiculous when not okay hold on i'll be right back let me get some water let me get some water for this shit. I'm gonna need some water for this. All right, let's go. Start playing. And the others were also practically insulting my design and the work that my amazing artist put in by saying that it looked copy and pasted like a generic. Uh, oh, they said all that. Oh, so that's when it got worse. Cause if she just said prissy bitch, I would have been like, all right, whatever. But to, to say all that, that's that's disrespectful. That's just straight up disrespect. So I can see why she mad as fuck. <laughs> and that e-girls were effing boring. As now we'll play the audio of a- Bro, so you're equating somebody with copy paste shit to being an e-girl. And e-girls have the connotation of just having sex online and shit like that. And then say she's boring. Like, bro, that's pretty fucked. Not even that, it gets worse. No shot, okay. Another individual speaking during this stream. What dragon women are supposed to look like in the VTuber Yo. community. Just pass, 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 pass. Mm -mm. Bro, I, okay, that shit I hate like, oh, that's not what it's supposed to look like in the community. Shut the fuck up. This community has been, I've seen shit from dragons that one looks like a dragon that's blue and one doesn't really look like a dragon that's purple okay and they're two of the most popular dragons and i've seen one dragon from another company that just have big ass titties okay so d don't fucking sit here and say what's a dragon and what's not a dragon bro you're not I an e-girl pacha uh, time out <laughs> i want muscles i want flat chest because dragons don't have tits bro shut the fuck up oh my god like bro bro oh my god like I'm fine with you saying what you like. When she said, I like flat chest, okay. When you say they're not supposed to have big chest, that's when it's like, shut the fuck up. You like, that's when you've passed the line of what's okay to say. Like, what's your opinion and what's being judgmental? And I want a big ass on them and a long ass tail with wings. And I want them to- Not everybody wants a big ass on their dragon model. Be fire and drag me into their cave. I don't want some prissy palace looking at me going you must kiss the royal thingies if you want to even touch the royal wing and she probably never even said any of that so now she's just putting words in her mouth so she's basically hating on this design 
solely on the principle that it's not what she likes. And then she's going to not only say it's not because I don't like it. It's because it's a piece of shit and it's copy paste. Like she's just saying all this extra unnecessary shit. That's what it is, bro. This is straight just blasphemy. You just cussing out somebody just cuz. No, get the out of here. You're not a dragon. You're just cosplaying as one. Off. <laughs> bro, wow. this that's not cool. That is and I get it. Like, that's her friends, right? So her friends probably, they probably just rock with it and let that shit slide. Like, but I don't know. Maybe they were nervous laughing, too. I'm not going to sit and automatically say they friends or, or bad people. But like, damn, ain't nobody like y'all supposed to be friends. You're not going to check your homie. Bro, if my homie, if I ever have a friend on here, a guest on here and we cool, but then they say some straight crazy shit. I don't care how long we've been cool, bro. I'm going to check him right then and there, bro. Don't say that shit. That's fucked up. Apologize, bro. Like. What are you doing? Y'all not even friends, bro. You need to check people. If you don't check people, how can y'all be friends? Individual responding what the fuck? to <laughs> Spitz tweet saying, nah, I've heard worse. But if they're upset about it, then I'm sorry it offended them that much. Oh, oh, I said what I said. I didn't mean any harm. If they don't like it, well, I'm sorry for hurting your feelings. Maybe you shouldn't have feelings. Yo, this person is a bitch. <laughs> Stranger though. And I get it. I shouldn't be saying that. But let's call a spade a spade. If someone's a bitch, they're being a bitch. You can be a bitch whether you're a girl. You can be a bitch whether you're a guy. If you're a bitch, in my eyes, you're just a bitch. It's like, it's not even gender locked. This shit can go to anybody. This shit is not even race specific. This shit is anybody can grab this skill right here on the skill tree. And for some reason, you grab that bitch. <laughs> My opinion shouldn't matter. Oh Same my God. Matter. Words are not my forte. I gave my apology. Whether or not they accept it or believe it is on them. Not it's for their fault. Hey, if they don't want to take my apology, then it is what it is. I tried. Yo, the fuck you did it, bro. For anyone else. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't have it. That as we have five. <laughs> bro, bro, the only people that say that shit seriously are fucking sociopaths, bro. Like, what are you talking about? Maybe you shouldn't have feelings. Up, <laughs> fucking robots say some shit like that. <laughs> this individual as well. Well, what happened to his audio? The energy that the character is projecting. But if you Bitch, what does that even mean? The energy that's projecting? It's a fucking, it's a fucking picture of a VTuber, bro. What are you talking about? What power is it projecting? It's just the energy that the character- I am a robot. I, I can tell for some reason you'll stream for like fucking two weeks and then like you shut down and recharge for like fucking three, four months and then come back. I'm just like, Pacha, what are you doing? <laughs> but if y'all are gonna get- It had to do with the design. It had to do with what we thought the character would be like. Exactly. There's the fucking difference. But they're this person is delusional. It all together to have an excuse to just pick fights. What? You started it. What the fuck, bro? How can you swing at somebody, and then when they swing back, you get upset, bro? That's bitch behavior. There it is, bro. Like, bro, how do you get mad when somebody swings back, bro? That's like if I push you to the ground and then I get mad when you get up and push me back and you don't even push me to the ground. You just like just push me a bit and then I cry. What yeah, is I this? Because she looks like a prissy bitch. What is I'm the smasher? So what happened on Twitter? I've been seeing this a couple times. The VTuber community, they for some reason, they'll be like, oh, let me see your model down below. Like, I don't know why they do it. I guess it's for networking. I don't know. But they just like leave your model below, blah, blah, blah. And then like they rate the model and they say, would I have sex with this model? Yes or no. Literally, it's called smash or pass. Will I fuck this model? Yes. Or will I fuck it? No. And that's it. Literally, you say yes or no. You could say why. Like, oh, I won't do it because it has blue hair and I don't like blue hair. There it is. Bam. Versus, oh, that's not what a dragon is supposed to look like. This looks like a prissy bitch. Like, this is not what a real dragon is. A real dragon got a big ass and flat chest. Like, you see, there's a difference between me saying I just don't like blue hair and what 
this person said. Sorry that my blunt language is living in 2D. Some of them are in 3D. Oh my god, shame on. I would say smash to all of them. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Down bad. <laughs> a hole is a hole. Down bad. <laughs> yeah, false, bro. This is crazy. This individual tweeting out afterwards, waking up to KYS and death threats. Well, see, this is the shitty part. Um, I don't like death threats. So even though this person has been doing some bitch behavior, please do not tell them to kill themselves. And lady, if nobody is telling you to kill yourself and you just said that so you can get people to like give you some cool off points, that's even more bitch behavior. Like, like I said, man, it's OK. I mean, just own up to it. Like, I think it's OK if you just like, yeah, I'm a bitch. And I'll be like, OK, well, I'm expect you to do some bitch shit. You bitch. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Over a harsh remark about the base design of a model is ridiculous. If you're perfectly fine letting your fans representing you in that nasty of a light, then you got way more to worry about than simulated bar talk. Spit wasting no time to tweet out, hey everyone, thank you so much for all the support and kind DMs regarding yeah, the situation. Exactly, However, it has come to my attention that one of the persons involved has received death threats and were told to KYS. Look, man, like I said, if that's true, if you did that, you're also a bitch. OK, like, no, doing death threats. No, if somebody deserves death threats, legitimately deserves death threats, then those are the same people I presume should be in jail for doing some gruesome shit. So we're not going to send death threats. We're going to call the police if it's to that extreme. If not, just say they're a bitch. Keep it pushing. You don't got to now. You don't have to just keep saying it. You could just say it one time. Leave it at that. You don't got to keep saying it because that like it's not necessary. I feel like it's unnecessary to beat a dead horse. Boom and done and just move on, bro. I do not approve of these messages whatsoever. Remember that this entire ordeal is to remember that there is a human being behind every model. No one deserves to receive any type of hate. Please be good to each other. That's true. That individual going on then to say this hours later. Okay, okay, okay. I see what all the BS is about. No. Well, yes, I said someone looked like a prissy beesh. The image on the Discord share screen and the screen on Twitch were two different pieces. Remember what I said about bitch behavior? Now, we all know damn well this is a lie. And even if it was not a lie, which I'm 85% sure is, I can't say 90, I'm not that sure. I wasn't in the room or whatever. But 85% sure that's a lie. And even if it's not a lie, you're still disrespecting somebody else's model. So it would still stand whether the, it was the blue dragon or the orange dragon that you didn't see or the rainbow dragon you didn't see. Whichever one had you said uh, not supposed to have big tits. Yeah, uh, this doesn't make fucking sense, dude. L -L Spoiler alert. Oh, so people found out she's lying. Surprise, people can't keep their lies straight on the internet. Bring where the F all that <laughs> stupid shiz came from. L-M-F-A-O. That despite already having quote unquote um, apologized mouth. on the tweet with the video of spit on screen. The individual saying further, the person who clipped the scene clipped the audio about a different picture we were looking at on Discord. And then we swapped to the other image and it all went together. A day later, this individual saying, I deeply apologize for the events that had happened the previous Previous day. Originally, I spoke regarding her model. Bro, imagine lying. Double down on the lie. And then admit the truth. Like, bro, if you lie, I feel like you should just stick with it, bro. Just stick with the lie at this point. Like, because regardless, if it comes out, you did lie when it even if everybody already knows you lied. At least you at least you stick into your guns and some dumb people believe sticking to your guns is always the right approach. Whether they're right or wrong, you stuck with your guns. Slash character. You'd have somebody. Speaking, but I will admit that it went too far that I directly insulted a. This is rage bait or maybe to enjoy the night. My 
maybe it is rage bait, but then I would feel like that that makes you miserable, bro. You sitting here making people get mad online for what clout? Like, bro, you're crazy. <laughs> Actions can't be fucking crazy. Excuse, nor do any of you have to take my apology at face value. It is your choice to forgive me. Again, I apologize to everyone involved. I will be taking a break from streaming for my mental health. Another video. Yeah, nah, bro. She's not rage baiting because you wouldn't take a break. If you were rage baiting, you got everybody mad, you would start streaming. You would start making videos. You would make so much fucking content because everybody hates you. You make the most money. What did Belle Delphine do? She pissed off the entire internet, dropped the fucking song, got the fucking bag, and then left. And then what'd she do? She came back, pissed everybody off, dropped something else, got another bag, and dipped out again, bro. Belle Delphine is the perfect example if you want to rage bait and become successful, bro. It just costs you your dignity and respect. But if you don't care about none of that shit, and you just want money, do that shit right there. Actually, this this was just somebody lying. Hosting that stream being yeah, this is somebody just fucking Gallo lying. Viking. Very Rage bait, yeah. Rage bait is uh, it's like used um, like a lol cow. Like you make somebody mad at you, and it's entertaining. But bro, this person said they're not going to stream, so obviously it's not that entertaining. You're not willing to do it live. That's like the ultimate. Spitz original tweet replying. I'm not the type of person who wants to hurt anyone, but I did. I was being a spineless <clears throat> for letting my own- Wait, 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 what? Did they say it? Did they say it? Wait, spineless where? Where's spineless at? Person who wants to hurt anyone, but I did. Wait, what? I was being a spineless <clears throat> for letting- Wait, I'm not the type of person who wants to hurt anyone, but if I did, I'd be a spine- Oh, God. My own stream. <laughs> Get this Thank you, I'm a boomer. Ball. Not going to hide behind quote, I didn't say this. Patchy, are you? Yeah, you are older than me. Damn. This or that, because it <laughs> That's is crazy. my stream, and I invited every person there. I should have spoken up. I should have realized how harsh we were getting picking apart other people's characters. This is not supposed to happen when someone gives their consent to their character being plastered somewhere else to be judged for a simple smasher pass. Holy shit, someone taking accountability. Man, this shit is rare. This shit is really rare, and this seems like an actual, hey, I fucked up moment right here. Please give me a second chance to be better. Like, damn. Chance to be better than I was today to grow the F up. I'm sorry. I don't know about that one, though. Like, give me a second chance. I'll do better. Like, I don't know about that one. All right. Spit <laughs> within the hour, replying, Freya, I accept your apology. And That's fine. I'm sorry that this got out of hand. It takes a brave person to make a public apology like this. We it all do. need to grow and be. It do. It do. It do. But it's also what companies are going to do whenever they fuck up. They do a public apology. Oh, man, it's okay. We forgive you because you apologize. I don't need yeah, better person every day. I don't mean this is. Yeah, better keep Everyone, your eyes open. Please, no personal Watch attacks you. on anyone regarding this issue. I want to move more in a positive direction from this. Spit lastly saying, hey everyone, the situation is over. Stop harassing, attacking, and blaming those involved. Let everyone have their peace. I cannot stress enough that these insults and threats are not acceptable in any situation. This will be the last time I speak. Bro, if you have to make three posts about this, people just don't fucking listen. And at that point, they're just using your they're using your turmoil to their advantage. There are people like that, too. They're like, oh, some, there's a reason to be mad at somebody. Well, let's just go ahead and just fuck with them because it's apparently it's OK. And if it's not OK, we could just say we're fans of Dragon Spit. Bro, this is crazy out here online, man. Speak about this. Or it wasn't was hers. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. I know this. And next, we're turning to the Orca of Shy Lily. Shy Lily. Tweeting out, please don't forget about me. Yeah, she's going to take this a vacation. My longest time off from streaming. Hey, hey, hey. Back. Hello, Jennifer. Welcome in, girl. Hey, hey, hey. Next week, Friday. Love you all. I wish you guys lots of love and happiness. Not so womp womp. As those looking so for womp, womp, some Orca VTuber fix now have Philly into the room. Give me your money! Give me your money, Jennifer! It's a robbery! It's a stick-up! It's payday time, fellas! <laughs> Rescue! This week, off collabing with Lena Lazar, and now coming to us with a special announcement saying, I recreated a Japanese game show IRL for VTubers. Let's go! Introducing VTuber Hole in the Wall. Man, I'm a little mad because I already wanted to start doing this, but Philian beat me to it. I'm gonna have to team up with Philian now. All oh, emotion. I hope it's fun. Capture in person. What? Did you get scared yet? You got scared? You thought I was gonna steal all your you're in Vietnam the dong? 
Vietnam dong, right? You think I'm going to tell all your dong? Live event is taking place on October 24th at 3 p.m. Pacific, 6 p.m. Eastern, and involving six VTubers, then involving Camila, Lena, Project Melody, Shy Lily, Tricky Wee, and Fillion. This I'm excited. This is one of the few instances that indie VTubers have had access to a motion capture studio in the English VTuber scene. That's Filling awesome. show being assisted by Mythic Talent how did they themselves get attending TwitchCon okay, this weekend okay, and okay. hosting... I'm like, how the hell did they get access to this mythic talent numerous vtuber meet and you never had any dog recently welcoming I'm a, on no dong this <laughs> the vietnamese money it's called <laughs> Wolfie Chu to the Mythic Talent Fold, and also now quickly turning us over to Oshi Live, known for their roaming VTuber meet and greet setups. Okay. Also coming to us with here give up. saying Oshi Live has opened give... the first ever high fidelity motion Yo, capture. Yo, that's studio, awesome! Specifically for VTubers in the United States. Bro! This effort being separate from the Fillion and Mythic show saying Oshi Live. Hmm, I think I found my first sponsorship partner. This is going to be interesting next five years. Open to indies and agencies. We offer the full package to make your stream Oshi or video Alive. a reality. As now today, we You're turn just to joking. Oh, you got me good. Mori Calliope, a busy reaper who is known to get very little rest. All Live Production English tweeting out yesterday, simply saying, big announcement from Mori Calliope tomorrow. Okay, well, the rest of this is just normal news. I just wanted to talk about the Smasher Pass, and uh, yeah, yeah. That was very interesting, though. It's good to see some cool stuff is coming out. What I'm really excited to see is uh, Yusan's concert, but I think I'll be gone, so I probably won't get to see it. But anyways, see you guys on the next one. Peace. What's up, Johnny? Metal Gear!